Pets have power over our brains, but it's a good thing and not like a mind control scenario. Dr. Brain has more. Let's be real, we love pets. In the United States right now, more than half of households have at least one pet. And it makes sense. Look at this kitten. Who doesn't want to have this little guy living in their house? And look at this dog. What a good girl. Look at that face, I just want to hug him. Look at this. I'm sure he's nice. Pet owners are not only happier and healthier, but they actually live longer which is great news because you get to spend more time with your pet. But having a pet can also mean having a healthier brain. Hi, I'm Dr. Brain. Okay, my real name is Crystal Dilworth, but I have a PhD in neuroscience, which is easier to call me Dr. Brain. So, I'm Dr. Brain! There are many reasons that scientists think that our pets are good for our brain. Simple routine caretaking activities like getting outside and taking your dog for a walk are good for both you and your pet. And sharing these healthy habits may be one reason why depression is less common in dog owners compared to non-pet owners. In fact, many surveys show that dog owners are the happiest pet owners, which might explain why dogs are the world's most popular pet. Don't worry, birds. Maybe you'll be more popular next year. Not to be outdone, cats have their own superpowers when it comes to our well-being. The low rumble of a feline purr has been shown to increase the release of neurochemicals called endorphins that block pain signals and help to reduce stress. And also, they're in all the best viral videos. The act of petting a cat or a dog also helps reduce the stress hormone cortisol and activates the release of other positive brain chemicals like oxytocin that stimulate feelings of safety, trust, and caring. Scientists showed that the brains of pet owners had less signs of physical aging, with some looking up to 15 years younger than the brains of non-pet owners. They were also better at orienting their attention, certain types of memory, and brain processing speed. So pets keep us active and mentally sharp, especially when they learn how to jump on your kitchen counter and are constantly shredding all of your paper towels. So you have to put the paper towels in the cabinet, but then your cat teaches itself how to open your cabinets and then, oh, that's, that's just my cat. Okay. Keep in mind, in order to reap the neurological benefits of pet ownership, we actually have to spend time with our pets. Just owning one isn't enough. Make a new maze for your hamster. Gaze lovingly into the eyes of your dog, and if you're a future herpetologist, feed a lizard or a snake or whatever it is lizard people do. You'll live longer, be healthier, and your brain will thank you. Bye. If you're watching this, you must have really liked the video. Make sure you follow and subscribe and check out these other videos that are even better. No, really, I've seen this one over a hundred times. Thank you.